guys, thank you so much for watching my video. I'm about to go to Iran and I'm so nervous because I'm going by myself for the first time ever. And I don't know, I just don't know what to expect. My flight has already been delayed a couple hours, which is always a buzzkill. But it's kind of nice because I got to stay home a little longer. So as long as, um, you know, it doesn't delay more, we'll be good. So we're on the way to the airport. My cousin is driving me and- the driver? Yeah, she's very Hello. cute, hi. Uh, my grandma is also here. I'm really excited. I'm very happy. I'm very happy. Hey guys, so I got this cake. It's called Kiss Kiss. And it's this is the only coffee bean they have in Oklahoma. It's in the airport. And I usually get the caramel uh, <laughs> blended drink, but I got the white milk and it's delicious. Sorry, that's not ex exciting at all. Okay, so it takes more than a day to get to the And um, right now, I mean, hour or two of like 26 ish. But this trip is actually the best that I've ever been on because usually it starts in the morning and right now it's like 5 p.m. So we started way later, not we, me, I started way later and um, that means that I don't really have to wait around in Houston and I just get on my flight whenever I get there. So hopefully everything goes smoothly here and I'll get to Houston. I wanted to show you guys um, my outfit a little bit better. So I'm wearing this just like loose shirt and then I have this light jacket on. It has these rays of it and this cool little logo there. I don't know if you guys can see. And then I have on these pants are literally pajama pants from Victoria's Secret. So comfortable and then super comfy, fuzzy slides. These are the best for traveling because I can just slip them on and off and they're so comfy and sturdy. But yeah. So I just landed in Houston and now I have to change terminals because I'm going international but I really have to pee and the only bathroom I saw was freaking closed. So I'm on a frantic search for a freaking bathroom and I hope I make it because when I have to pee, I have to fucking pee. So we'll see how that goes. This airport is the emptiest I've ever seen it right now, and I'm enjoying that. It's it's helping me not be as stressed out, but I still have to be. I'm in the international uh, terminal now, and I know that because it smells like bougie perfume. <laughs> uh, but still haven't found the restroom. Oh, looks like I found it. My search is over. Okay, so I finally went to the bathroom, and I literally had to pee on the entire flight that I was on. And it was just horrible. So I'm really happy that I got to do that. And I don't know why I'm sharing that with you. But I have about an hour until we start boarding for the next flight. So I'm just going to walk around the terminal. Maybe show you guys some stuff. Maybe get my last American meal until I come back. Yeah, that's it. So we're gonna start boarding soon and um, that means that it's time to like do my nighttime routine because basically this this flight is overnight so I'm gonna be like sleeping on it. Um, so like I wash my face and brush my teeth and stuff and I just realized that I forgot my toothbrush and my toothpaste and it's such a buzzkill because I don't get to brush my teeth until I get to Iran which is pretty gross because I want fresh breath. Mm, I just have gum but yeah so I'm gonna go wash my face 
not interesting at all, I know, sorry. This terminal didn't have very many restaurant choices, so I have to stick with the shitty airline food, which is gonna suck, but I have, um, I have Pringles and like little uh, chips and things and snacks and things, so that will hold me over. I really like this art. Um, I'm about to board my flight. Boarding my flight.
I always come to Istanbul and eat fucking Burger King and I just shake my head at myself, but I don't really care. I want Burger King. So I'm sitting in this terminal right now and it's pretty much empty. Um, it's not my gate, but I'm sitting here um, watching that 70s show and I'm about to eat some Burger King. I just got chicken nuggets and fries. When I finish eating, I'm gonna get ready for my next flight and then go to my boot. So yeah, this is a chill ass trip. Usually I'm with a bunch of people and they make it stressful. These chicken nuggets are so lit right now. And I got these fries, hell yeah. Here's a mini view of Istanbul. It's so beautiful. All those little dots in the background, those are houses. That hill back there is just full of houses. It looks a lot like San Francisco. I was able to get a toothbrush from the last flight. So I brushed my teeth, I washed my face, and got all that shit done. And now it's time for the last flight. I'm not tired at all. It's crazy because I'm usually like dead at this point. But yeah, we're about to leave Istanbul and then I will keep you updated from there. Thank you for your cooperation. I turned my hair back so that it will be easy to put my job on later. As you know, in Iran, you probably don't know that, but in Iran, you have to wear jobs. So, yeah, that's why I turned my hair back. I'm excited. I'm here with my sister. I just got to Iran. Everybody is judging me. But yeah, 